what today is at stake in philosophy is the fact that uh, we need the, the, this formulation is a quotation from Nietzsche. We need a broader reason. Uh, uh, we come now to the end of uh, uh, a narrow understanding of reason. And this is not an issue only for theology or religious uh, stuff and things like that. It is uh, it is barely needed uh, for our relation to the to the world. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, the crisis of nihilism uh, uh, reaches uh, our relation to nature, our re relation to history, our relation to uh, to uh, our soul, that is, how far we are human, what, it, what does it mean to be human, and uh, uh, all those questions need to be addressed in another way. Uh, uh, it is not by transforming everything into an object, as we have done successfully, uh, that we can we, we will, uh, we shall be able to, 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 to meet the challenge coming. That is, objectivation is a great thing, but we can use that only for a, a, a very limited slice of the real world. It, it does not allow us to go deep to the bottom of it. That's it. I think the question, uh, what is true, what is the truth, is one of the most essential and important questions we can ask as human beings. And one of my heroes uh, in asking this question was St. Edith Stein, um, who lived from 1891 to 1942 and in effect became a martyr uh, to truth and her deepest convictions about God and what it is to be human. Uh, and so faith and reason are two really harmonious and complementary avenues through which to pursue this question of truth. And St. John Paul II talks about this in his opening lines, a 1998 uh, encyclical, Fides et Ratio, and he talks about the relationship between faith and reason like two wings of this eagle, uh, the human heart which soars to the contemplation of truth. So I think in order to pursue the fullness of truth, uh, we must rely not only on reason and exhaust its capacities, but also turn to the possibility of divine revelation, God revealing things to us that reason alone cannot grasp on its own.